am Mr. R. I'm here to celebrate smoothies for everyone. And as long as I'm getting my 100% discount, they're on me. So, what are you celebrating? There's an advanced math class for the top students, and my teacher invited me to join it. Congrats, Olive. That's awesome. Hey, Sid, you're just in time. We're celebrating Olive getting into the advanced math class. Well, then I'd say you should make it a double celebration, because guess who also got into the advanced math class? <laughs> me. <laughs> what? Really? Advanced math? Sounded a little too surprised there. Want to try again? <laughs> Don't get me wrong, I'm really happy for you. I just didn't think you liked math that much. Well, maybe my love for math has multiplied. Look at that. I even use math in my free time. So, Ms. Williams did ask you after all. Well, let's just say we had a little talk, and bottom line, I'm in. In that case, math class is going to be a straight-up polynomial party. <laughs> did I just hear you girls got bumped to the advanced math class? Thanks, Grandma Jay. Yeah, thanks, Grandma. You guys aren't the only ones taking a challenging class. At college, I signed up for the philosophy of the ancient Greeks. That's so cool. You're going to spend months exploring life's deepest, most profound questions. Here's my first one. Why? Because I have a deep and profound interest in the teacher. When it comes to the meaning of life, Professor Cutie may not have all the answers, but let's just say he checks all the boxes. Here you go, math superstars. Thanks, Dad. And of course, this doesn't mean that we're better than anyone else, but doesn't mean that we're not. <laughs> what do you say we post a picture? And we should probably mention that we're in the advanced math class, you know, just to keep people informed. Sure, why not? Math sisters! Here, take one of me. Look at me solving a problem. Ooh, this one's a toughie. Are you getting the book? <laughs> yeah, got it. And the best part about being math sisters, we can study together. You know, this class is going to be really hard, and I think I'd prefer to study on my own so I can focus. Oh, yeah, OK, sure. Wow, these pics are great. I am going to post them all, unless you think it might come off a little too braggy. Well, maybe a little And too... posted. <laughs> Noodle, look at you. Hard at work. Looks like I'm not the only one. How's philosophy going? Great. I finally chatted with Professor Cutie today. He told me he loves everything about ancient Greece. So I said, if you love ancient Greece, you should come over and clean my oven sometime. <laughs> Good one. Plus, the oven could really use it. So how's math? It's advanced, but luckily so am I. Hey, you want to help me check my work? The answers are in the back of the book. Sure. Okay, number one, x equals five is right. Yeah, it is. Number two is wrong. Of course it, wait, what? <laughs> and so are the next three. Sorry, Noodle. What? No way. Four to five? That means I only got 20% right. Well, at least you know your percentages. That has to count for something. <laughs> Hey, Olive, what you been up to? Let's see. I just took off my shoes. <laughs> cool, cool. So I just called to thank you for helping me today. No problem. Anytime. How about now? Problem four. <laughs> now? OK. The first thing, you got to put all your A's on one side of the equal sign and your numbers on the other. Got it? Got it. Thanks. Now. Quit gabbing and get back to work, lazy bones. <laughs> Guess who? <laughs> the person who just called me with a math issue. <laughs> Said I really need to get back to work. Oh, come on, Olive. We always help each other. I mean, you needed help in English, I would dive right in and help in any way I could. Any way 
I could. Okay, you're right. Let's go back to problem one. More like problem fun, am I right? Yeah, 